Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while since I have actually sit in front of my camera. Uh, 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 I'm so excited. I'm home, guys. And, uh, Oh, the facial. Anyway, welcome, 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 welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a facial mask, homemade facial mask made of natural ingredients. They are no preservative, no additives, no form of a chemical, 100% pure natural ingredients. We are talking about this wonderful anti-aging tightening facial mask that I'm going to share with you today. So guys, if you're looking to tighten the skin, if you're looking to firm the skin, if you're looking to fade those wrinkles and fine lines at home, in the comfort of your own home, whipping up something in your kitchen, using it and looking amazing stepping outside guess what this video is for you so continue watching now let's begin our first ingredient is papaya and this is blended papaya this is about three tablespoons of blended papaya peel your papaya blend it and you have puree papaya now papaya is wonderful for the skin it helps to lighten and brighten the skin it also helps to get rid of wrinkles and fine lines and it helps to boost the collagen production in the skin overall a very wonderful anti-aging ingredient to use on your skin now moving on to our second ingredient and this is another awesome ingredient here I have some aloe vera gel fresh aloe vera gel what I do I extract the aloe vera gel I blend it and here we have fresh aloe vera gel now aloe vera gel have many benefits to the skin it contains a vitamin A and also vitamin K it helps to clear the skin of spots and blemishes it helps to brighten the skin it helps to get rid of fine lines and wrinkles it helps to hydrate the skin it is good for sunburn it is also great for boots in the collagen production in the skin now if you're looking to fight wrinkles here is one ingredient that is a must this is great to take internally and it is also a wonderful ingredient to use topically and this is none other than green tea green tea is loaded with antioxidants and minerals and vitamin that is great for the skin it helps to slow the aging process down it helps to get rid of wrinkles and fine lines especially around the eyes and the upper lips it also helps to boost that collagen production in the skin and it also helps to hydrate the skin it penetrates deep into the skin and it also helps to clean those pores out and just leave your skin younger fresher and radiant just give that skin a wonderful glow using green tea now take a look at our next ingredient and this is a wonderful wrinkle fighting ingredient this is avocado puree what i did i just peel and blend the avocado now avocado is loaded with a lot of antioxidant properties that is great for the skin it helps to boost the collagen production in the skin it helps to lock the moisture in the skin it helps to hydrate the skin it helps to slow the aging process down and it also helps to leave your skin just bright clear and supple now avocado is a wonderful wrinkle fighting ingredient to use on your skin by itself or you can choose to mix it with other ingredients like I'm doing today for a more effective and a more stronger treatment for your skin. Now let's take a look at our next ingredient and our next ingredient is a dried rose petal awesome ingredient to hydrate the skin it also have a wonderful fragrance that is gonna make this facial mask just smell really wonderful but however it have to lock the moisture in the skin now if you do not have rose petal powder not to worry go ahead and use some rose powder it's the same we're just gonna blend the petal to turn this into a powder you can even choose to use some rose water in this recipe now guys we are moving on and now we are gonna blend all these wonderful ingredients together I'm using one tablespoon of the fresh aloe vera gel
I'm gonna be using some rose petal. We really do not need a lot of rose petal, probably about a tablespoon of rose petal also, give and take. You could add more if you want it to be a little stronger. And next, we are gonna move on to the papaya. And for the papaya, I'm gonna be using one tablespoon of the papaya puree. Pour that in. And then we're moving on to the avocado. And I'm also gonna use one tablespoon of the avocado in this recipe. Now you can double up on the ingredient if you wanna make more. This amount is great for just one mask. Also gonna add another ingredient to this recipe and this is fresh milk. If you're vegan, go ahead and use some almond milk. You can even use some soybean milk in this recipe. Now milk contain lactic acid. It have to brighten the skin. It have to clear the skin of spots, blemishes. It have to shrink large pores and it also help to hydrate the skin. Really an amazing ingredient to use on your skin. So for the milk, we're using about one to two tablespoons of the milk. You can also choose to use a little bit of a yogurt if you do not want to use the milk in this recipe and then we are gonna blend and guys I totally forget to add the green tea so I'm using one tea bag of the green tea if you're using loose leaf go ahead and use a teaspoon of the loose leaf I'm just gonna pour this in and then I'm gonna go back to blending Now take a look at this and here it is. This is what it's gonna look like after blending. Don't forget to take out those that is stuck in the cover. And once you do that, you are gonna give it an extra mix. So just fluff it up with your mixer. And here we have our anti-aging facial mask. Now this facial mask is gonna help to do a number on your skin. Look how rich, look how amazing this is. Now you're gonna apply this to clean skin and you're gonna leave it on your skin for at least 30 minutes. Also apply this to the neck and decollete area. After 30 minutes, you're gonna rinse this off with some warm water. Then you're gonna rinse with some cold water pat dry the skin and apply your favorite facial toner, serum and moisturizer. Now this facial mask can be used two to three times per week for best result. And you could store this in your refrigerator for about a three to four days. You could keep it up to seven days if you so choose. Now use this facial mask about two to three times per week and you're on your way to beautiful, amazing looking skin so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video and leave your comments and guess what guys I have a show every Friday 1 30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time where we talk about skincare like you know all these amazing ingredients that we use in the natural world and also out there in the synthetic world of skincare thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video so tune in every friday 1 30 p.m for let's talk skincare with chichi beauty go ahead and give this wonderful facial mask a try use it for a week or two and come back and leave your comments okay bye bye <music>